The Korean government is getting serious with the worsening air quality in the country. It's rolled out a five-year plan to tackle one of the nation's chronic concerns, fine dust particles. But it's not just about clearing the air. Our Kim ji Yun starts us off with a move expected to fundamentally change the way Koreans use energy going about their daily lives. The government will set aside a combined 4.4 billion U.S. dollars through 2020 for clean air policies amid concerns about the levels of ultra-fine dust in Korea. The Environment Ministry said in a joint press briefing Friday that it will allocate the lion's share of more than $2.6 billion to increase the number of eco-friendly cars in the country as automobile exhaust is seen as a major polluter of fine dust. With the cooperation of other related ministries, we've come up with a plan to increase investment in areas that will help boost our plans to clear fine dust from the air. The vice minister also unveiled plans to increase the number of buses running on compressed natural gas, reduce fine dust emissions from coal-fired power plants, and reduce air pollution from ships. He says some of the funds will be pumped into other projects, such as the installation of electric vehicle charging stations nationwide and a 70 percent tax cut for drivers who replace their old cars with more energy-efficient models. On top of that, he said the ministry is aiming after a trial period to limit the entry of old diesel power vehicles into the Seoul metropolitan area by designating a low emission zone to be announced later this month. Kim Jian, Arirang News.